Roxy Horner, who is dating the actor and comedian Jack Whitehall, was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes in May 2021 after she suffered from low energy levels, appalling memory, and continual sickness. The 30-year-old model revealed that she was rushed to the hospital after a friend called an ambulance. Taking to Instagram on Sunday, Roxy revealed she was forced to seek treatment and admittedly has been having a really rough time being a diabetic. The model expressed her gratitude at being in the UK after learning there was a shortage of medication for the condition in Ukraine amid the current military crisis. In view of her 193,000 followers, Roxy began, After my last post on diabetes I've had a few messages on how I'm managing and the truth is I'm trying my best but it is still hard. I've been having a really rough time managing my glucose levels the past few weeks, they are yo-yoing for absolutely no reason, I throw up when I go too high and I've had a few too many hypos for my liking lately. She continued, My friend had to call an ambulance for me the other day, I was starting to lose consciousness, my entire body was shaking, my levels got pretty low and wouldn't come back up even after drinking 4 apple juices. It's so weird to me because I'm still figuring this out and a month ago I really thought I started to nail it but it's always going to be a roller coaster and I know soon it'll feel much better, maybe even tomorrow, it'll be fine. My problems feel so minuscule on the scale of what's going on in the world and I count myself lucky that I'm safe in my own country. In an earlier post, Roxy shared her dismay as she detailed the lack of vital medications available for people in Ukraine after Russia invaded the country last week. She admitted she couldn't fathom the fear any sufferers must feel knowing medication is in short supply. On Thursday, the World Health Organization WHO, released emergency funds to purchase desperately needed medical supplies. A statement released by the organization said it is deeply concerned for the health of the people of Ukraine in the escalating crisis. It read, the health system must continue to function to deliver essential care to people for all health issues, from COVID-19 to cancer, diabetes and tuberculosis, to mental health issues, especially for vulnerable groups such as older persons and migrants. Roxy has previously opened up about her struggles with diabetes in a candid chat with Marie Claire last year. Amanda Holden 51, appears to go braless in sultry silky blouse latest death in paradise's Ralph Little on issue close to his heart admission Catherine Zeta-Jones so proud of Michael Douglas at SAG Awards Awards, she explained that she was diagnosed with the condition a month before celebrating her 30th birthday. The model told the publication, Type 1 diabetes has changed my life but the silver lining is that perhaps it has taught me to stand up for myself and listen to my body. Roxy who said she was chronically stressed ahead of her diagnosis and very thirsty admitted that her model agency had been supportive and her famous boyfriend incredible. The model said it was a shock to get her diagnosis and there were days when her condition had knocked her out and she felt unwell. She claimed she initially discharged herself too early from the hospital to attend an awards ceremony and had to be readmitted that same night during the first few days of diagnosis. Roxy added, the first few months were really scary. Meanwhile, the beauty has taken to the picture sharing site and issued a plea via Instagram stories today. It comes as residents in Brisbane have been urged to evacuate as the area has experienced flooding in Australia. Roxy Penn, thinking of everyone in Brisbane affected by the floods. Been so worried about my family this past week. Their hometown is completely underwater. They've been sending me daily videos and it's just crazy.